Boss fight again. I suppose that 98 tr retries on this weaker variant would drum that name into your head. Fuck, I don't remember, man. Oh, actually, no. I remember doing this on the point device mode, but remember, it was in Japanese, so I actually wouldn't have known the name by at that point. So that actually would make sense. Tori? Okay. Of your own establishment. Yep. Baby switch. Let's go with this one to be quick. There you go. You tried your best, prove to me that you're slacking. You, you said this quest complete. So we're done? Yes, for now, but please come. Yeah. Back to Marissa. Evening, Rain. You off on another half asleep rampage through our home once again on your grand tradition of vanquishing the imperishable night. Don't act like we didn't talk earlier. Normally, your sass would not spare you my rap, but I'm trying this making friend things you suggested. Oh, you've been talking to them. Maybe challenging them to games? Is it Junkin? Spell Bubble? No, not really. Not being allowed to beat people up does put me in the mood for a good puzzle, though. Oh, I've got a good one for you. Let me try. You really don't have to. Nah, it's no problem at all. Passionately showed me this cool word game puzzle. A game. I promised to return some of her books I was borrowing. Yeah? It was really fun. Go on, Dan. Let's hear it. This word game is called Hear Me Well. I say something, and you try to figure out what out the rule. If you fail around, you have to reset the whole thing. So I'll, I'll keep it short for you. Remember that's a rule with the words I use. Hey, pal. Hear me well. I think you need you need you use spell to win. You need to use be between. What rule does my game use? I want to hit you. Hey, now the game's over. No one to be salty. It wasn't that bad. In fact, I'd say we make a nice combination. I suppose it was pretty clever, and you you do it well. Later, Marissa. And thanks. Bye bye. Have fun with the others. Come talk to me again. I still don't know what the fuck I did there, but sure, we accomplished that. Okay, so it looks like no Tay, because I wasn't too sure how they're going to handle that, because Tay is an important character, but she was a mid-stage boss. Oh, hi, Remu. Is it that time already? That time? The time when you blame darkness on us because even in winter, you hate waking up in the dark. I need someone to blame for your plight, so you inevitably come to A&T, take it out on my master and the princess. Ah, yes. Except this time, Marissa's told me to try and be friends with you all. Chat a while. Or do some quest or puzzle or whatever. Oh, in that case, will you be willing to help me? You see, Tay stole my ice cream, but I'm on the job and can't chase her down. Could you do it for me? I mean, sure, I guess. Wouldn't it be the first time wouldn't it wouldn't it be the first time I chased down a mischievous yokai such as her? Thank you so much. Please come back to me after you catch her. I was looking forward to that ice cream. Okay, so we do have to deal with fucking Tay. Let's catch that. Boney. Oh boy. Oh wait. Oh, so tired. So help me. What the fuck? Like a billion texts just flew by. I'm not important in Earth Rabbit business. I totally not scrounging on my spare change to go buy a raisin a new ice cream. Go apologize for her to me for me already. Hey Raisin, I caught Tay. Where is she then? She went off to some important Earth Rabbit business. She told told me to tell you she's sorry. Ah, oh, see, well, I suppose it's fine. I feel like I know what her important Earth Rabbit business is. Thanks for your help. I mean it. And thanks for deciding not to beat us up today. Thank, Mar thank Marissa for that one. I was just gonna beat you all up like normal. Ah, uh, now that's the Raymond we all know and love. There's Aaron. And thus, Raymond Hawkeray arrived to once again put a stop to the so-called Eternal Eternal Night 
Vignette? Vignette? I'm not sure how to say the word, to be honest. I actually don't know. Bet you wish I was with your obnoxious spell cards and your Earth Magical Revival by Kaguya and your super powerful Earth in a Jar of Magic. You're even wielding your bow as if you have a desire to let loose an arrow into someone's chest. Um, maybe, maybe, who knows? Gotta check something real quick. Uh, make sure my camera's working, because that would be annoying if it was not working. Oh, let's see. Okay, everything's looking good. All right, let's see. I'm simply holding that bow this way because the artist thought it would look cool. Maybe I do wish to shoot someone. It's been a very long time since I have. Have you ever considered taking up archery for sport? Such is beneath me. I only tend to tend to the princess and perform my medical practices to my whims. How's that going for you? Invented any more illegal drugs yet? The ultramarine elixir orb sounded very useful even if we didn't use it. The elixir is very common to linearians. It isn't something I invented on the spot. Though I'm sure to a mere human, it seems very powerful. Now that's actually a good question. I do not remember if the Ultramarine Elixir Orb was a normal thing made in the Lunar by the Lunarians. I know Aaron gave it to Ramus, Sare, Marissa, and Raisin as an option. And canonically, they didn't use it. So I don't know about that. I actually don't know if, if, if the Lunarians actually made this. Bold words for someone with magic within spell card range. You're lucky that Marissa wants to be friends with you instead of beating you up. Oh yes, we did discuss that sometime. Do you know how hard it is to keep patching up clothes? Well, if you're not here to find the past, you may partake in a simple puzzle. I found it in a certain newspaper the other week. It may be trifle and simple, but I'm sure that a human such as yourself is fine with that. Fine, whatever. Stop insulting me. There's a target with rings with the following scores. 40, 39, 24, 23, 17, 16. Assuming I have an unlimited number of arrows at my disposal, how close can I precisely get to 100? Oh, do I have to fucking add them up? Wait, out. Hmm. Let's get my calculator, which I have right here, which I'm using for my statistics class in university, so yeah. I'll talk about that more later on, so yeah. Let's do this. How many close how close can you get oh get to a hundred points? Hmm. Why the fuck am I doing this? I can't I can't can I just use the fucking game? Let's go with 96. Okay, never mind then. I was clear not thinking of the thing correctly. Whatever. Who knew that a bun bun nu who knew that the bun bun root contains so much knowledge of petty things that ultimately mean nothing? Literally everybody. Alright, Kaguya. Salutations to you, red and white shrine made of hawk ray. Are you joining this night? Oh, what a good view of the moon. Oh, with a good view of the moon. I don't like the dark at all, actually. It's hard to see, and the yokai are no more annoying at night. Well, we cannot be all be as dignified as the night sky. I suppose it can be understood why you hate it so. Good to see you're not listening to what I actually say again. Really like that. Now I understand you have received our plea not to have skirmish every time that you wake up, and decided to blame that continuing night on us. Marissa said that I, I should simply talk to you all and wait out the dawn. Yes. Then how would you like to be my? How do you like to do my quest? Uh, it is the same one that I used to give up potential suitors long ago. I, I pressed the space by accident. So long as it is to sign me up for some strange arranged marriage, if I succeed, there are five items I need you to collect: the stone begging bowl of the Buddha, the jeweled branch of Horai, the legendary fire rat robe, the colored jewel from uh, from around dragon snack, and the quarry of the Sallows. Swallows. As you may know, I'm in possession of these items, uh, these things. Thus, I have hidden them around the area for you to find. My five requests that so many humans in the past have failed to complete. How many of them can you fulfill? 